Portland Theater, Portland Wrestling, and joining me in the Crow's Nest right now from being down on the floor at ringside, Johnny Fairplay. All right, look out there in the ring right now. You've got Mike Roselli, Iron Mike Roselli, uh, showing off to the crowd, doing a little posing as we get ready for... Uh, as we get ready for our next match here at the Roseland Theater on Portland Wrestling. This is going to be Mike Roselli against Kenny Lush. Kenny Lush is crazy. <laughs> well, this Don, this guy is insane. Well, they call him Loose Cannon. And he's happily named. I think his mom named him that, and that's not a good thing. <laughs> well, but but then again, look who's talking, Johnny. Hey, huh? My mom used to pull around horse jockeys. Where do you think Fairplay came from? I was almost Johnny. She's a winner. Come on. All right, down, down goes Lush with a uh, smash from uh, Mike Roselli. Now Roselli doing a little more posing to the fans. Well, this is the kind of stuff that can backfire on you. He should know better than this. He runs a school, WrestlePlex, up in Canada, Vancouver, B.C. He turns his back on his opponent. Well, I think, uh, you know, he is the teacher and Kenny Lush is a student, so I think he knows exactly where Kenny Lush is in, is in the ring. And, and uh, if he wants to take the time to tell those idiots what he thinks of them, you know, which I'm going to do. Uh, there you go. Well, I'll tell you what, the, uh, the rookie just put a nice hip toss on the, uh, on the teacher, Mike Roselli. Roselli is down right now. Now, listen, don't go away. We've got, uh, we want you to be at our matches at Roseland Theater on the 29th of September for a huge announcement. And uh, also, we're going to bring you up to date tonight on Josh Wilcox. We're going to bring you up to date on the uh, on the cruel, uh, you know, that that, that uh, the, insurance. The, the insurance thing where when the cruel took a fan right out of the crowd and and uh, I don't agree with any of it. Just I loved what I saw before. I, I wish I could see it again. I, I, I uh, you know, September 29th. I, I, I hope he comes back and I hope he grabs two more fans. So, uh, well, we got Iron Mike Roselli outside the ring right now. I'll tell you what, uh, he might be thinking about heading back to Russell Plex. <laughs> or else, uh, or else it's been a night of full of hard knocks. <laughs> yeah, well, he might, he might be. You know, we've got, in just the Northwest, and you consider Vancouver, B.C. in the Northwest, two excellent professional wrestling schools. The School of Hard Knocks right in Portland, and, of course, uh, Mike Roselli's uh, Russell Plex in uh, Vancouver, B.C. Yeah, but look at this right now. Kenny Lush is taking Roselli to school. Look at this. He's, he's looking good out there right now. He's got an arm bar locked into a figure four on Roselli. Roselli is, uh, is down. He, Roselli's spending quite a bit of time on his back in this particular match. Into the ropes goes Roselli. Coming off the ropes, a hard shoulder tackle. And down goes Lush. Over goes Roselli. And... Oh. <laughs> Roselli's a teacher and Kenny Lush is a student, but, but once again, I said, well, Kenny Lush is crazy. That's all I didn't do. You, you know, you can't, you, you can't factor in insanity. Well, you got to be a little, a, a little different to accept a match against somebody like Mike Roselli when you're a rookie like Kenny, Kenny Lush is. And uh, there's, a, there's another nice, is that kind of a fireman's carry type of movie? <laughs> Modified. Actually, that, that, that might have been the, uh, the crazy man carry. Yeah, the loose cannon carry. And uh, Roselli's outside right now. Well, well, we've got a chance. I want to remind you, before we go any further, about... No. Oh, yes, oh, yes. It is true that size does matter, you know. And at Rocco's Pizza, it's really true. The largest pizza slices in town, Rocco's Pizza at 10th and Oak downtown, right across from Powell's Bookstore. And you can go in to Rocco's Pizza and get a coupon. Yes, you can. And that, uh, that's good for $3 off in your admission to the Roseland Theater. Rocco's Pizza, that's right on the street from the Roseland. Of course it is. Yes. That's where, where all the action in town happens, all right? Rocco's Pizza. You spend a lot of time at Rocco's Pizza, Don? As much as I possibly can. I love that stuff. Man, I want to get those coupons. That's the only way I can save getting in here, you know. <laughs> save three bucks. Gee. All right, now Lush has got to Roselli. Into the turnbuckle he goes. Coming off the turnbuckle, another nice one. Smash. Who's the teacher and who's the student here? Those coupons at Rocco's, getting back to that, they can make good Christmas presents, don't you think? Oh, yes, that's a gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> you bet. <laughs> 
Into the ropes goes Roselli. Coming off the ropes and uh, oh, Lux misses with a haymaker. And uh, Roselli does not miss. Although, look. Look at Roselli now. Roselli still, he's hes winded. He's had the breath taken out of him doing the crowd thing again while Lush lies collapsed in the middle of the ring. That was well, Mike and up. <laughs> yeah. Roselli ain't up too. And there, go, there he goes back to, uh, to Lush right now. Grab a handful of hair outside over the top rope onto the floor goes Kenny Lush. And Roselli uh, going to join him out there. He might have split his head open uh, coming over. Uh, at the side of the uh, side of the ring apron on his way down this doesn't look and there's uh -oh. the metal chair and we got the metal I folding chair in action again and uh, down across the uh, back of Kenny Lush uh, I still say there is no place in professional wrestling for metal folding chairs we're going to have to take a break though I'll tell you what uh, Johnny Fairplay we're going to take a break and to be right back with more action you're not going to miss anything Told you wouldn't miss anything anything important that we're picking up where we left off the action outside the ring. Mike Roselli's got Kenny Lush and throws him back inside. I'll tell you what, I love that steel chair to the head. You, you might not agree with the Don Cost, but this is uh, wrestling the way it is. Uh, it's the way it is on the East Coast, and, and I'm glad to see a little bit of that flavor slip out here in the Pacific Northwest. You know, you hear us talking about uh, Rocco's Pizza and the Gun Broker. If you would like to be a sponsor of Portland Wrestling, here's what you need to do. Call the office at area code 503 235 Four, uh, 9942. That's 235 9942. Get in on the action. And uh, hey, I'll tell you, the business will be glad you did. Does that money go straight to your pocket? Is, that, is this all you? <laughs> I, I have nothing to do with that. I just I just read it. A leg drop by Mike Roselli. That's I, a nice new watch you're wearing there, Don Cox. And it did not come from Rocco's or a gun broker. <laughs> Uh, hey, listen, I'll tell you what, I'm looking forward to the, uh, as we watch the action in the ring there, we're going we're gonna to show you an update on Josh Wilcox, his appearance last week, first appearance, that's the first time I've seen him in a year and a half uh, on Portland Wrestling, and man, I'll tell you, he is not the same guy I saw here last year or a year and a half ago, this guy is bulked up, he is cut, he is looking good, and certainly he looked good the last week. This kid talks about WCW, being on WCW, being on ECW, his Hall of Fame dad. I'll tell you what, that, that kid, he was on the front row for WCW. I mean, you know, the, the guy got over by holding up a sign saying, hey, Ma. I mean, come John, on. Johnny, you're much too small to be saying those kinds of things about Josh Wilcox. You might want to watch your mouth here as we watch the action in the middle of the ring. Mike Roselli really doing a number right now on Kenny Lush. He definitely looks like the teacher right now. Well, I'll tell you what. Josh Wilcox, when you see him, you, you are absolutely going to be amazed at uh, this kid is very, very mature. He's very impressive, and he's very big. <laughs> well, he's been to Dory Funk's jo dojo, but I'll tell you what, I, have, I haven't seen him show what he can do yet, and I, frankly, I don't think it's there. Hey, always remember, Bart Smart, he told me that, and I don't think he lied. Just remember that it's in his blood, Johnny Fairplay. It's in Josh Wilcox's blood. His father, Dave Wilcox, just uh, elected, and, and uh, he's in the uh, professional foot NFL football Hall of Fame. I mean, uh, he comes from good stock, my friend. And he used that time to cut an interview for his kid. I mean, come on. How much of a push can one guy get? Well, I don't know what you're watching or listening, but uh, 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 we're going to show you an update on Josh Wilcox and uh, the impression that he made of Portland Wrestling last week. All right, there goes Roselli into the turnbuckle and down. He bottoms out. Compliments of Kenny Lush. I tell you, you got to hand it this to this guy Lush. Look at this, a, running it from across the ring, smashes into Roselli. He's giving it all he's got. That is a knee to the face, and guess oh. what? The knee doesn't give. <laughs> and, the, and the face is is looking a little weary out there. The face of Mike Roselli. Roselli is tired. He is he he has been beaten good by this uh, this young man Kenny Lush. Roselli's ever bragged about being a handsome man. <laughs> I don't know if he has. I missed it. Well, he, he does a lot of bragging, but I don't know if that's part of it. Okay, up to the top row. Oh, oh, man. That's going to change his social plans. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that, that changes uh, his voice, too. All right, coming off the top row. Oh, man. He just went on the back of his neck. Yeah, Kenny Lush is, he is hurting out there right now. I hope that this is not... Uh, I hope this is not a career-ending move right there. He landed on the back of his neck. He is uh, flat out, and this is the a three count right here. 
We've got crazy or not. That that is terrible. We. I hope the I hope the young man is all right. Mike Roselli, the uh, the winner over Kenny Lush, and we uh, we do need to get some uh, some help out here to Kenny. We're going to be back. Oh wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold it. I. Now, do they use chairs at the WrestlePlex? Look at this. Mike Roselli brings in a, a, a metal chair, and he's got Kenny Lush is already hurting. That's a power bomb, Don. That's right power onto the chair. We, right. could, we might see the end of Kenny Lush right here. Oh, he's, he's not trying to beat the man. He's trying to end his career right now. Mike Roselli, just look, look at this. One smash him. Now, now he's, he's, uh, he's taunting him. He's telling him, don't ever mess with Mike Roselli. Don't ever mess with the teacher. And uh, Kenny Lush is... Is in a hurting way right now. All right, we'll be back with more. And uh, I'll tell you what. Oh, wait a minute. Well, no, let's stay. Let's keep it right here. Keep it right here. Comes Fade. He's gonna. He's gonna help his friend Kenny Lush. Fade has got Roselli on the run right now, and they're going out through the crowd. We're kind of losing uh, track of them a little bit. Well, thank goodness Fade came to the rescue of Kenny Lush. Oh my goodness! I tell you, we will be back with more action from.